Hello everyone, Praise Scooter here, and welcome back to more Shantae, Half Genie Hero. Last time we defeated a big ol' worm, and now for your for your station mandated transformation. Ooh, a elephant. Now, if I remember correctly, as soon as you get the elephant, oh no, I'm wrong. I guess we have to do a little bit more, but yeah, we get an elephant. It's big, it's heavy, which will help with the sandstorms bit, but it also bashes. So, what can this do for us? Well, well, we'll find out in a little bit because we do have to go through plot things before we can move on to, before we can move on to actually, you know, you know this bit before we can actually go explore. Yes. Uh huh. Oddly prophetic. Um, uh, you know what? Just let Uncle have it. All right. Make sure everybody is okay. Current blueprint needs supposing shards create a balance of positive and negative energy. I... Well, I mean... Nobody likes dark magic. It has to exist, unfortunately. I know, it'll be right at the supermarket. I'll go get some. Okay, but not. So we have an elephant. And we also want... Now we've cleared a level. We do want to take a lap around this around this area to see if any anybody new has shown up. Quick dip to make sure I'm full on magic. Uh, that guy does nothing. I'll be back to you in a minute. Oh, hey! Hi, best character. Hi, Roddy. Surprise, they're dead broke. They're also dead. What is something nice? So yeah, Roddy Tops. As I said, best character in the game. Hi, Twitch and Vinegar. What are you doing here? Uh... You know, that's what people always say, and then they immediately cause trouble. Is it, well, no, Chante, it's kind of on flambe. Huh? Huh. Oddly specific. Well, this is kind of why I'm... I've got to remember, I've also... I had another recording session that flopped, so I don't remember what I have and haven't told you right now. But I hope you've, uh... Pulled off and give you some extra race tick. I like that. So remember when I said you should probably kill the gators with fire? That's why. Uh, how about that race ticket? Well, we have one of two race tickets, but we're still missing a race ticket. Later! Don't cause trouble. Please. Anyway, let's go shopping really quick. Let's see what I can afford with what is available to me in money. Well, it's nothing here that I want. I believe what I want to do next is get... The next level of whipping speed. There's still one more stage beyond what we have, but again, I said I did say you know alternate, so we'll probably get this one next, or maybe I'll uh, splurge and get the scimitar next. Basically, my favorite magic in this game, 
But yeah. Oh, I didn't mean to talk to you. I meant to... I meant to hair up. The sad part is I can get faster. Anyway, as per usual, we do have to go and backtrack to certain areas. Now, I will tell you, there is nothing new in... I have to think for a second. Yeah, there is nothing new on Main Street. So, for anything new, we have to go to Mermaid Falls. And I believe it's going to be the... Se well, actually, no, there's going to be two things in Mermaid Falls. So, I'll just meet you at those areas in Mermaid Falls. Okay, that's something I didn't know that could happen. In my haste to get make sure I got my timer back out, I didn't know you could crush that platform. Now, we were here before, if this is what I'm thinking of, and we couldn't do much here. But now that we have Elephant, Bash. Oh boy, something new! It's a mermaid dance. So the exploration has triplicated. And we can even do it in this area. First, how about you try it out? Now that we have... Well, at this point, we have a fifth dance. At which point, any any longtime Shantae fans will be like, Hold on, hold on, hold on. Shantae can only have four forms. What's going on here? A, a second wheel will appear. Or a third if you have acquired some of the optional stuff. Just hop yourself in and look. You're a mermaid. The crab will still be useful as the mermaid is still two tiles big. Whereas the crab is one tile. But this is how you'll get. A, this is how you'll probably get around water for a while now. Once again, Wormaid or Wormaid, Mermaid is kind of defenseless on land, or is kind of defenseless. Period. But let's go use our new ability to our advantage. Ow! By getting yourself whatever this is, which is another gallery key. And again. This will be something we'll do at the very end of the game, like, almost the last thing we're going to do before we go take on the final boss of this segment of the game. Huh. Still can't get in there. So even though we have Mermaid and we have access to swim around wherever we dang well please at this point, that we are still barred off from specific locations. Now I won't... Now, at this point, we can access something on Main Street, but I will make that a return trip for another, for a little bit later. So I believe at this point, we actually, I will actually cut ahead again, and I will meet you, I will meet you uh, in the second part of Mermaid Falls, basically inside in the factory area. Alright, this is right about where you want to be. So this area in the, uh, this area in in the uh, factory area of Mermaid Falls has well, hello. It has whatever this is. So heading over and talk. Hello there. Hi, Grandma Blobfish. Oh. Why over... You know, I'm not going to ask how you know about cereal. You know what? Sure. I mean, we're in the business of helping people, so why not? And now our crab is no longer defenseless. So, at this point, we have found... At this point, we have found... How many blobfish ki children? Two of them. So we have found two of the Blobfish Kids, and all the other ones are hidden here behind Kelp. Which we have to cut our way to. But there's also some other things we do. Now, I did say we're no longer defenseless, but you still gotta play careful. Because the enemies that are here to stop us still can make an issue. But all it is now at this point is just a go through areas you've been in, and find your way to goodies. And pick up some sunken souls along the way. Oop, well, I'm just a fool. Try that again. Well, can't get in there. But hey, what we learned along the way is that uh, crabs are dangerous. Anyway, let's backtrack a little bit more to another area. 
No, there's going to be nothing down there. But in here... I believe in here will be the last two Blobfish kills, the kids. This section right here. Four out of five. And... All the way to the left. Oh, is there one more? I guess there's one more segment. But yeah, still all the way to the left. Not here. I believe. I believe I can make that jump. Hold on. Dang it. Okay, I cannot. Which sucks, because I'm not going to have to take the time to transform. I feel like I'm misguiding you at this point. Because I know there is at least one more kid in this area specifically, but where is the mystery? Oh, there it is. This is the only problem with getting way ahead of yourself, getting way ahead of yourself and collecting is that sometimes you forget what goes where. Anyway, cost me off my noble steed. And all we gotta do is just head back to the right. And we should be handsomely rewarded for our time and efforts. I did the thing, Grandma Blobfish, what's up? I have. Uh, please don't do that, I'm pretty sure I don't want to see a uh, explosion of Blobfish. Why do you... You know, it's best if I don't ask questions. Well, thank you. And at this point, we're... Done in Mermaid Falls for the time being. But we st but now that we have the Mermaid Transformation, we actually want to go off to... We actually want to go off to the water areas of Main Street one more time to find a couple more things. Now, I believe this is the puddle we were, we were interested in because... Yeah, remember we couldn't get up here with the crab? Well now with Mermaid, we can talk to this guy. What are you doing here? Sure you are. Yeah, yes, actually. What do you think I'm playing right now? Uh, that... Your game sucks. Uh, it's like from the... Oh? Hey, how is weird? Ow, the edge. Now I'm going to check some more, but I'm pretty sure we're done here on Main Street once again. And we'll need to actually go back to... I think we'll actually need to go to Tasseltown now in order to make any further progress. So... I guess I'll... Unless I'm wrong in this, I'll meet you back in Tasseltown. Actually, I'll come with you right about here, because at this point... This point in the game here, roughly, is where... Is where things start changing in Tasseltown, because... There's no windstorm anymore to kind of blow you back, or kind of hold you away from, the, from this objective anymore, so... Huh. Neat. So you can, you're free to kind of move at your own leisure in this area. And that'll be something we'll have to do a little bit later. I remember there being something we can do at this point. Maybe, I hope I'm not ahead of myself. Although knowing how I work, I probably am. Which sucks, because in my last recording session, my failed recording session of this, I got here. I got to this, I got into this area in Tasseltown. And did a whole bunch of stuff. Alright, it's this. Hold on, first things first. Just uh, farm a little bit of money here quick, hold on. That was fun. Anyway. Let's use our elephant to its fullest ability to ignore the sandstorm. In order to come in here and... Get another transformation. So with the spider transformation, 
Uh, I actually sent out the thundercloud. I also sent out the wrong thing. With the spider transformation, as long as you're in ceiling, you are one tile uh, tall, but on the floor, you are still two tiles. So yeah, spider transformation. Now we can do something with this uh, in the tower coming up here. So I will meet you. I'll meet you just a second in the tower itself. And here we are in the tower itself. Hello. Is that your... I like the design of this character because it makes me think it's like... It's one of those... It's one of those faces that can be seen. It's one, of, it's one of those things that is a face no matter if you look at it upside down or right side up. Not me. A genealogy guy. Billy a family tree. What? what uh, I'm here for looking for maids. Maids all around us. You can tell we're very because flowers grow trees. You grow there. God damn it. Person turns into plant food. Got it. Got under the remains. Dirty job. But comes territory. And with that, we get the elephant stomp, which doesn't open up anything else in... Still does not open up anything new in Main Street. But it does open up some stuff in... I think it might open up... Well, with the couple with the spider dance we just got, we have something we can do back in Mermaid Falls again. And we can do something at... We can do something at, uh, what you call it? Something in the first part of this place. Anyway. So yeah. Remember how I said remember flowers? I said remember flowers. Now I might make some stops in Main Street still because I think there were one or two flowers out there we can mess around with. So I'll probably head out there just to revisit those floral locations. But... With the stomp, it's very much a simple press down and you tackle. Also, oops, wrong, wrong transformation. Also, with the elephant, Donkey Kong Country rules apply. Get one more set of remains. And there are, and there are flowers scattered all over, all over like every level up to this, up to the point now, up to now. So I would recommend you do that when you, we're done here, you do take the time to go back to other levels and see what those flowers can give you. Also, to kind of replace the danger now that most of these uh, traps have disabled, is we have buzz saws all around this place. Also, snakes come out of the come out of the ceilings in certain locations. You know what, I'll take the hit. It's fine. Now this one we can't do anything in for now. We'll have to come back here later. I love that beat in that song. Just that it almost sounds like somebody made a mistake while on the uh, synthesizer. And it's like and there's like, you know what, keep that in. That was cool sounding. Anyway, Grave Robbing has its rewards as well. As you can see, we're actually very high up on money already. Oh, come off of it. And that's why I also told you, you know, hey, think Donkey Kong Country when it comes to this, because even if you even it doesn't yield remains, you can still go in places and get access to some stuff. Also, the next generation of worm is here. Sometimes when stopping the flowers, all they will give you is uh, money. Which kind of sucks, but eh, what can you do? Anyway. And here we get another gallery key. That which is 3 out of 10 in the game. I hope I mentioned it better when that when the gallery did come up, but there's there's ten doors we can go in, so we need a key for each and every door. Anyway, we can't get access to that one. Nor those, but this one we can do something with. 
Yes, we can look at it like with a monkey. Thankfully, all all the remains are going to be in this tower area, so we don't have to go through any extra endeavor or expense at this point. God, I, I, I don't know what it is. That note, I love so much. Just like somebody meant to hit the bass drum and they accidentally hit the like the snare instead of instead of correcting themselves they hit it like three times over. Oh, snake is crush. Anyway, last one will be here. Also, there's that door there. Oh wait, there's something to the left. Actually, we'll make it. We'll come back to that another time. So dash, stomp, and we're and we are done here. And, like a good game, it will teleport us right back down to the guy. Yeah, they are. Have your remains, sir. Oh! Uh, cover your mouth. I will, but... We'll have to handle it next time. So everyone, thank you all so much for watching this episode of Shantae Half Genie Hero. And come back next time when we'll, I'll meet you a little further up the tower, kind of back where we are cut off. And we'll see where we can use this stomp, this spider dance, and a few other things to our benefit. I'll see you folks next time. Take care.